the real setup right here. This is why I suggest you do. All right, get the winch, set it up. You got, you got the positive and the negative. That comes out all the way down to the solenoid. Real simple. The solenoid goes. It's it's marked. It's red on black, and you got once again red on black. Real real simple, right? The rest of it just goes color coordinated. So you got. Uh, the blue one, as you can see here, is already set up for you, so you don't got to worry about that one. That one's already set up. The black one, you take it on out to the black wire. Connect to the black wire, the green one to the green wire, right? At this point, the instruction manual is going to tell you to hook this up to this confusing thing right here, right? Which is going to allow you to operate the winch when it's on, right? Or when your ATV is on. I really, once again, I really don't care. Sometimes I'll even want to operate the winch when my ATV is off. So why would, why the heck would I even care about hooking this big thing up? And and also, I don't really care about a remote start anyway. So anyway, so this side goes out. I'm gonna pull back over here. This side goes out to over there. That's that that's the positive lead over there, connecting to the battery. And this goes out to the negative lead. And I'm actually going ahead and I'm going to be hooking up to my truck over there. And so not an ATV. That's why I really don't care. Another reason. So this comes together. And it comes out over here. And then comes out this little red line over here. And you just connect this to the positive as well. So you connect this to the positive and you can connect this to the positive and that's really all you got to do and you got your nice switch over here so you see you don't you really don't need that that uh see in and out right you don't really need that uh that remote switch at all so basically the point of this video is this stuff gave me a lot of headaches these two right and in the end i don't even need them look at all that complicated wire look at this what is this freaking what the hell this is how you do it this is how it's done Real simple, once again, you got the winch carrying on down to the solenoid, go off the two leads, positive and negative, then going down to the control operation. And don't forget to fish the little tiny little string back to the positive wiring, and you are done. It's really that simple. I'm